They are haunted by the way you outgrew their expectations. Please scroll on. If this doesn't resonate, the grass was not greener. They chose someone else, but you were divinely guided in another direction. This was just a very rough rejection, but no. You make me feel understood. You really outgrew them. You have outgrown them. They're so mad now because they see now that they left and you were just on this divine path. It's like it, it scares them. Whoever they are, they're actually scared because... They've never seen this kind of transformation happen to someone after they left. They thought they were the one with the transformation, but it was you. I'm really getting like divine transformation, like divine glow up. For real. I am drawn to your light. You would have left me anyway. This tells me that they're they're really trying to console themselves about this grass they chew. <laughs> they are haunted. Because it's one of those things where have you ever, um, as soon as you break up with someone or, you know, you go your separate ways, whatever, they end up in a relationship like long-term or married, thinking of you. Um, that's what they thought had happened with them. They thought they went on to this great relationship. They're like, oh, this person was holding me back. But now they're seeing it completely different. And it could just be they're reminiscing, look, this person does not need to be back in your life. That's what I'm really supposed to tell you. But they're drawn to you now. Look, they're not going to leave this situation. I really need you to know that. Like, do not reach out to them. If they reach out to you, it's one thing. But I don't think you should go back to this. That's You're beautiful inside and out. And you are not of this earth. You've just got other things going on. You've got other places to go. When I tell you you were divinely guided, here's a funny thing. Let me get back to what I was saying about how they thought they were the one that went on to this great situation. And something, it was just kind of mean, like, but I'm really getting that they wanted to leave you in a bad situation. That's horrible. It's not even that you did anything. They just wanted to feel like they were doing better than you. They wanted to feel superior, but they don't feel that way now. They really just honestly feel like you parted ways and then suddenly you just got like beamed up to heaven or something. <laughs> Or to the top of a, of a mountain and you're just looking down on everybody like, you know, you're just up there. <laughs> it's just funny. Like, they see you so different. And you probably see yourself. You attract good things. This is what I'm talking about. Exactly what I'm talking about. Go easy on yourself. You will not be deceived. Ooh. Okay, this, this is funny that this came out. Attract good things. No, they're just, they don't know what to think about this. It doesn't matter what they think. They're the one with the limiting belief, not you. You know what I mean? So, don't let them get in your head. I, crazy. Three cards to end this reading. They just have to watch it. That's their karma. You become wealthier every day. Look. Every day. They're watching you attract more good things. You age in reverse. And you flow with love. That's what's happening. Keep flowing with love. Unconditional love. That's drawing all the good things in. Okay? I manifest that for you. That's what's funny here is you've flown with love, becoming wealthier, aging in reverse. Every time they look at you, it's like more good things, more glowing up. Keep glowing up. You got this. You deserve the glow up. You're glowing up even more. You were to got divinely guided away from them. And I, I manifest that if you want an amazing relationship, that that's what you get. A healthy one where you... I haven't said this in a while, but your best friends who can't keep your hands off each other. Isn't that what anybody wants? I manifest that, that you find that people, like somebody who doesn't get on your nerves, you know what I mean? Because I was thinking, man, I wonder if that would even exist for me, because I just can't even imagine it, because I, uh, I don't know, if this is not about me, though. I'm just going to say, like, it's hard to imagine even wanting to touch someone, because people get on my nerves so bad. But, you know, new earth, let's manifest the new earth. No one gets on my nerves. Maybe there's someone, who knows? Who knows? Anyway, I manifest that for all of us. That we just end up in the situation that we're happiest with, whether it's alone or with someone else. But if you want someone, may it be a best friend. You can't keep your hands off each other. You age in reverse. You become wealthier every day. You attract good things and you flow with love. Oh, hold on. You are beautiful inside and out. It is spoken, it is written, and so it is. Amen.